celebration of the greatest. Tens of thousands saying goodbye to Muhammad Ali with that huge public memorial in his hometown this afternoon. And ABC's Ryan Smith is there in Louisville. Good morning, Ryan. Good morning, Michael. This is exactly how the champ wanted it. A funeral procession passing by his childhood home in this Muhammad Ali Center and people coming from miles away of all races and religions to his hometown for a final farewell. This morning, tens of thousands descending on Muhammad Ali's hometown of Louisville, Kentucky for a final farewell to the greatest of all time. The send-off fit for a king and planned by Ali himself. A 19-mile procession past his childhood home to his final resting place. 500 police officers guarding the route. And to cap it off, a memorial service for 30,000. The free tickets gone in under an hour. Foreign heads of state attending. Bill Clinton and Billy Crystal slated to eulogize the champ. Will Smith serving as a pallbearer. But this celebration of Ali starting Thursday with his Muslim faith at the forefront. The Islamic funeral prayer service drawing 15,000 of all races and religions. Use exalted position of fighter in the ring to deal with social justice beyond the ring. And Thursday, Ali's grandson Nico sharing a rare sound. In this FaceTime video, the champ giving his grandson his final bit of advice. Stay in shape. Stay in shape. Among the eulogists, Muhammad Ali's wife, Lonnie, and his eldest daughter, Mariam. And those who couldn't get tickets to the memorial service can watch it from a large jumbotron nearby. One person who won't be here, President Obama. He'll be attending his daughter Malia's high school graduation, Michael. All right, thank you, Ryan. And, and what an incredible man who transcended any sport that he ever played. First time I ever met him, I leaned in to say hello, and he looked at me and he says, can you rumble? <laughs> <laughs> no, we're nothing like you, Chip. Nothing like you. Always have those great one-liners. Always. And I know, George, you will be anchoring a special report with live coverage of Muhammad Ali's service this afternoon here on ABC. Yeah, it's going to be quite a celebration.